Hello everyone, this is Mike, and in this video, I'm going to demonstrate the Teammate controller, uh, the TM-2. A uh, big thank you to Franco and Barbara from ELAT for providing me the Teammate controller uh, for this video. Uh, SDR Uno fully supports the Teammate USB controller. I'm going to pull it up. I have an additional webcam, and uh, later I'll zoom in to show the actual display that's over here. Uh, this is the Teammate. It's an uh, optical encoder with push button. Uh, you have uh, two additional knobs here that are also push button. Uh, you have buttons across the bottom, which are uh, F1 through F6. Uh, this thing is built like a tank. It's uh, rock solid, and it, it's fully supported in SDR Uno. Uh, let me launch SDR Uno, and I'll show you how to configure this. It's uh, really simple. So just bear with me, and uh, I'll get SDR Uno up and running, and I'll show you the teammate, and then I'll zoom into the screen. Uh, on this LCD, uh, it's this way you can see. The first thing you want to do is go into the uh, main module and select Teammate. You want to enable the server. You want to auto assign, and everything just everything here has to be clicked. Uh, by default, it's not. Uh, so just have these four options enabled. Give yourself some separation between the tune and the LO and we'll hit play. Now just give me a moment and I'll tune us into a station using the uh, teammate, not the mouse. Okay. Let me uh, mute this for one second and I will explain to you what the buttons do in SDR Uno. The main tuning knob is going to tune the VFO, that's the VRX actually, that's selected. So as I'm turning this it's going to change over here and it's to the step size. You can change that step size by pressing F1 or F2. So I'll hit F2 and you can see right here in the RX control it says step size. So let me hit F2 and now it's at 500 as you see right here. One kill, uh, one kilohertz, five kilohertz, 6.2 and so on. I usually like it at uh, 250 hertz. The E1 knob is going to control your volume. As you can see here, the, I'm pointing on my screen. <laughs> Over here is the volume control. So as you uh, increment and decrement it, it's going to change here. Uh, the E2 knob is going to change the filter on the aux SP, as you see right over here. All right, now let me get this uh, up and running. And I'm going to readjust this camera so where you can actually see what's on the LCD screen. So just bear with me. Okay, on the LCD screen, uh, we're showing uh, DBM, which is right over here, and it matches up with what's going on over here. So this is saying 92.993, and that's showing right over here. Uh, this is giving me the signal strength over here, which matches up with the signal strength over here. It's showing me the frequency, and uh, that's basically it. Let's, uh, let's tune around with it. Let me move this uh, over here. And we'll see how well it performs. Now today is uh, ARRL Field Day here in the United States. And there's a lot of stations, as you can see right now, on 20 meters. So let's go into the uh, voice section. I'm general class, so I'm allowed to range from 14,225 to 14,350. Uh, so I'll start over there. Okay, and we'll go into upper side band. And as you see, as I'm tuning the knob, it's tuning in SDR Uno. Good luck. 
a lot of activity today. Whiskey Kilo One Fox, good afternoon. I copy. Now also in SDR Uno, this is set, uh, the optical encoder is set that if you spin it fast, it's going to speed up uh, automatically after a certain amount of revolution. So if I go really fast, it's going to go right through really fast. And you can just go slow or speed it up here. And you can whip right through a band. Now I want to go back into the LCD to show you the uh, signal monitor, how quick it, it responds. Uh, with SDR Uno. Just the filter, as I said, uh, with the E2 now, so we can go, we can go higher or lower. It's really convenient this uh, TM2. And that's basically it with the TM2 controller from ELAD. Uh, again, thank you to Barbara and Franco from ELAD for providing me this controller uh, to show you guys how it works inside of SDR Uno. I'm actually going to work a few stations. Uh, it's field day, and uh, I want to try to make as many contacts as possible and fill up my log. So I'll say seven threes to everybody. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.